A cargo train derailed in the Southeast Democratic Republic of Congo, killing at least seven persons, according to a local authority. The accident occurred Saturday in the village of Biofui, Lualaba Province, and was the second in the area in the last two weeks. According to the official toll, a train derailed in the same area in mid-March, killing at least 75 people and wounding 125 more. According to Lualaba Interior Minister Diata Kapenda, seven persons died and 14 were critically injured in the recent disaster. According to him, the toll could grow because a big number of smugglers were trapped beneath the upturned carts. A rescue squad had been sent to the location. The eight-wagon train was traveling from Tank, in Lualaba, to Kananga, in the neighboring province of Kasai Central, according to a local official from the national railway firm SNCC. It began its journey in Biofui, some 200 kilometers, 125 miles, from Kulfsi, Lualaba's province capital. Because there aren't enough passenger trains and few passable roads in the vast Central African country, freight trains are commonly used by those who need to travel large distances. Experts believe that the recent series of train derailments in Africa is not just due to overspeeding, but also to antiquated rail equipment and bad railway management. To further ensure the prevention of such events, a comprehensive rehabilitation and regular upgrade of the railway network has been proposed.